So fitting a Sovic letter recognition to a K750 or an M72. Um, I've taken off the old unit here, the old distributor. Fitted the new ba the electronic base plate with the uh, slots midway, with the screws midway between the slots. Um, I had to find some screws. The kit doesn't come with screws and the original screws are countersunk so you need some uh, round headed screws. Um, I did have to elong or just make that slot a bit wider because it wasn't a very good fit, whether that's because the ignition's at fault or the back plate could be either. Um, I put the adapter on the camshaft. Uh, that was pretty self-explanatory, but the small countersunk screw was a tight fit in the barrel nut, so I had to work in and out a few times. You want to make sure that is clamped tight to the camshaft, because I have heard of the adapter coming loose on the camshaft and damaging the uh, the, the pickup. Uh, then the pickup has been adjusted on these slots here, a bit like adjusting a set of points. So you've got a 0.5 millimeter gap there. It's not mega critical. It just means you just need to make sure the rotor isn't going to hit that pickup at any point because they're only plastic. There it is. Um, the new coil, which you probably can't see, is mounted where the old coil was there um, on the brackets that come with the kit. I've had to make up some extension wires um, to go on these spade terminals. So here's to take the power to the coil from the unit uh, there. Um, the green wire is the positive feed from the ignition switch which goes onto the spare red wire via that uh, sort of little connector block there that comes with the kit. Um, that's about that. Now, uh, the rotor I've put on and just nipped it gently so it's, it's, it's it's up to the adapter so you can set the gap on the pickup but you can still twist it a little bit like that so what we need to do now is to find top dead center now some people take the cylinder heads off but you can just feel the piston if you've got a handy something like this i've used this allen key we put that in there There we are, there's a bit of guesswork involved. You can't rock the engine, unfortunately. You can only turn it one way unless you take the gearbox off or something. Um, anyway, so I'm confident that's near enough top dead center. Because um, you end up doing it by ear anyway. You don't, uh, there's no timing marks you can line up to. You just have to adjust it by ear and by riding it. So now if we put the ignition on. Uh, you twist the rotor until the light comes on, like that and then just twist it anti-clockwise until it just goes off. So clockwise until it comes on, then anti-clockwise until it just goes off. Then you lock that off with a spanner. Now that should be close enough to start the engine now. So we'll put the spark plugs back in and see if it starts. Oh, incidentally, you want to have the spark plugs, uh, or should probably turn the ignition off before I muscle around. Uh, you want to have the spark plugs at all times, either in the engine or just resting on the top so that they're not dangling in midair. So if you get a stray spark, uh, there's somewhere for the current to go. And they're Champion L86C, by the way, the spark plugs. Right, ignition on.